Hello everyone, uh, today uh, I would like to make a video about our uh, Trios and how it's connected to our computers. Uh, we just received our wireless Trios uh, not too long ago and we're very excited about it. But before we actually talk about how this is com connected to the computer, uh, let me talk about how our uh, monitors and uh, TV screen is connected to the TV uh, for our Trio scan. So we have uh, the computer monitor at 12 o'clock position, but it's not a really good position uh, for scanning. So what we have is we have our assistants move the uh, window from the 12 o'clock position to the 6 o'clock position. Uh, on the TV screen. So this way, uh, what we can do is uh, while we are scanning the patient, we can actually see what's being scanned uh, in the six o'clock position. So if you're already a Trios user, uh, you'll notice that on the top right corner uh, that there's two new icons. Uh, one's for the battery life. Uh, the battery life is, I feel like it's not that great. Uh, you can scan maybe two patients, maybe three if you're really fast. Uh, but that's about it. But the good thing is uh, it does come with uh, three batteries, so you can uh, recharge them as needed. So if you click the uh, Trios uh, icon, uh, what you, this will show up. So you can turn off the scanner uh, when you're not using it to save battery life, and then you can turn it back on whenever you need it. Uh, and there's a button for uh, disconnecting the scanner from the computer, and we'll talk about this uh, shortly. Okay, so now let's actually scan uh, something to show you the uh, speed. Okay, so I'm just going to scan a denture. So as you can see, the uh, speed of the scan, I think is probably similar to the wired scan, uh, but I guess uh, as we use it more often, we'll know if it's uh, good as the wired one. Uh, but so far, we've been very happy with it. Uh, now, let me talk to you how we have our trios connected to our computer. So if you look at the monitor behind me, like there's a Wi-Fi adapter that comes with the trio scan. So this is connected to the computer. And if you have uh, multiple operatories and multiple uh, computers and you want the wireless trios to connect to each one of them, what you can do is you can buy this uh, wireless adapter uh, on Amazon. It goes, uh, it's about uh, $55, which isn't too bad. Uh, and basically what you do is you connect uh, one of these to each computer and then you can uh, disconnect from one computer and then connect to another computer very easily. And let me show you how we do that. So now if we look at the uh, TV screen and if you click on the uh, Trios icon, there's an option for disconnecting uh, the scanner from the computer. So you just press that. And then now the scanner is disconnected. And now uh, I'm going to show you how to connect to another computer. So if you want to follow me. Okay. So as you can see, all you need to do is bring uh, the trios with you. And if you look at the screen, you go back to the upper right corner and click on the Trios icon, and then you click on the scanner. And sometimes what happens is it says that the scanner is connected to a different computer. So uh, if this shows up, all you need to do is just click OK, and click the icon again, and click on your Trio scanner, and then it'll connect. Okay? So, let me just demonstrate that it's connected. So this takes some time for it to uh, get connected. Okay, and then as you can see, you can start scanning your patient in a different operatory and the connect, disconnecting and connecting is fairly easy. Uh, I would like to thank uh, 3D Biocat, uh, Charles and Jack for all the uh, support and help uh, and thank you for watching this video.